Yo, what's going on guys? So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can go ahead and edit your camos to be any color, image, or video that you want. And specifically how to go ahead and get this secret rainbow camo that in my opinion looks absolutely insane. So before we get into that, I'd just like to give a huge thanks to Jocks IA for helping with the footage for today's video. So be sure to check him out. His link will be down in the description below. Go ahead and subscribe to him and just show him some love. So before we get into that, I want to quickly mention that this video is sponsored by DigiZani. This website will allow you guys to purchase in-game currency, video games, and boosting services. And specifically for Call of Duty, you can navigate over to DGZ Gold and purchase things like max level weapons, max prestige, dark aether, and DM ultra unlock services, and so much more. Make sure to use code eradicate for 5% off your purchase. You can also go to DGZ Gold Giveaways and enter to win some awesome prizes. So big shout out to DGZ for sponsoring this video. I greatly appreciate it and remember to use my code when making purchases for 5% off. So first things first, you can do this on console. However, you will need a PC to apply this filter to your gameplay. So to begin, you're going to want to load OBS and get your gameplay running in the background. And while this filter can work on any camo, it works best on camos like Dark Aether that are all one color and are rarely seen in game. So the trick here is that we are going to apply a filter to our gameplay that changes the colors that we see on screen. So you're going to go down to your gameplay, right click on it, and then select filters. Then you're going to add a new filter and click on chroma key. Once it's added, go down to key color type and click on custom. Now click on select color, and I found that the best color to use on the purple dark aether camo is hashtag 8000FF. Then finally change your similarity value to 290. So what this chroma key filter does is it looks for the color that you selected, which in this case was that really bright purple, and then it cuts holes in your gameplay wherever that color is seen on screen. So since we don't have anything else behind our gameplay at the moment, it's just black. So if you want to change the color of your camo to, let's say, red, go back down to your sources, right click, and then add a color source to your gameplay. So if you want red, just click on red, and then once it's added, just drag it below your gameplay, and you'll see that now those black holes are now filled in with red. And we're now left with this really cool red dark aether camo. So as mentioned earlier, you can put anything you want behind it. You can make it a custom color or even put an actual video behind it. So what I've got here is this really cool rainbow video. And that's what we'll be using to make the rainbow camo. So just go ahead and add that and you're going to have the rainbow camo effect on your gameplay. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. And if you did, please be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing so you never miss a video like this one. And with all that being said, guys, my name is, of course, Eradicate, and I'm out. Peace.